But, ah, we're starting the next uh, episode after a long discussion about Alibaba and Aladdin. Uh, you want to explain while I look this up? Well, essentially, I think that Aladdin was supposed to be Disney's kind of, like, adaptation on the Alibaba story. Which is an old folktale. Yeah, Alibaba and the 40 Thieves. I'm super not sold on that. Especially since he just looked it up and it said that his own father was representative of Alibaba. No, his old father was Kasim. Different guy. But he... Uh... I'm not having this... I'm not having this debate again. Look, we looked it up. There's a sequel called Aladdin and the 40 Thieves. Which... I never watched the sequel because it didn't have... Uh... It didn't have... Uh... Robin Williams in it again. Oh, so you don't watch these films just because Robin Williams isn't in him? No, just because usually Disney sequels suck. Sure. I never I, even saw the sequel. But that was because I, I didn't know there was a sequel. Ex exactly! They're usually straight to DVD or straight to video releases. And pretty much every single time they're either garbage or okay. Whereas the first one is great. Now let's watch this for a second before we continue. <laughs> She's hiding so well. <laughs> oh, sorry. I just saw her blank stare forward as she was clearly visible. <laughs> they can never find oh, me. Never. All I'm right. Jasmine. My father is the Sultan of Agrabah. Uh, so that makes you a princess? Thanks, Goofy, who sounds like Sora. But he has been disposed by Jafar. I totally didn't know Goofy who now said that. controls the city. Huh. Jafar? More? Or? You haven't heard of him? Strangers who don't look like me? His royal vizier. Oh, his royal vizier. He gained evil powers and seized Agrabah. I don't know why I had a hard time reading that sentence. I don't know either, man. He's desperately looking for something. Something. Something he calls the keyhole. I would stay away from this man, Jasmine. Do you like my pants? <laughs> I like that. <gasps> Jafar caught me trying to escape, but he helped me. Uh, but let, let's let's just let's just wait for this for a second. I just I just imagine Goofy has just been sitting there the whole time, slowly saying Jafar. <laughs> Jafar. <laughs> because he's had that text box open the whole time. <laughs> All right. I don't know what he says at the end of every one of our sentences. <laughs> Jafar, who helped you? We were hiding nearby, as you can see, but he left a while ago to take care of something. Oh, I hope Aladdin's all right. Aladdin? Where might I find this? Cutscene transition. Threat? Jafar! Jasmine. How did you I find me? You find you more suitable company, my dear uh, magic. Princess. These little rats beautiful. won't do you see. Jasmine, run! Uh, that's jogging, ah, princess. The boy sprint. Who holds the key. Sprint, lady, sprint. All right. <laughs> I like that little zoom in of Donald's face. He's just so surprised. <laughs> All right. Gotta fight. Gotta win. Just gonna watch you do this. You can do this. Yeah, the first, like, I'm gonna look up Alibaba, the 40 Thieves, tail. I want to see the overview, I guess. He comes across treasure and becomes really famous. All right. It's essentially. So I that's think... just it. That's it. That's his entire story. Uh, I mean, I think he starts trying to like promote, um, help. Like helping out the citizens of the poor, and uh, the poor citizens in the area. But I mean, other than that, not really. 
Probably. I don't know. I've never actually read this story. I'm just going off adaptations. I don't think it involves a genie, though, unfortunately. Hmm. All right. Hey, look, it's a pot. Not pot's hey. Oh, it's a child's tale. No, it's it's been adapted into a child's tale. A lot of really young kid videos about it. Yeah. I mean, it was often a tale told to children, but it was suppressed most of the violence in it, so people didn't get too violent. All right. Aladdin's house. Oh, saving. boy. Because I save at every save point, because I'm not certain whether I'll live through that. Hey, hey. Being a totally unsuspecting person, I see this rug. Okay. This is nothing like the story of Aladdin, aside from the fact that he finds a cave of treasure. Sh should I help this rug? Hold on. I, I was looking at Google. Let me look. <laughs> oh, poor rug. Yeah, yeah, help rug. I love him. He's my, he's one of the best characters in Aladdin. Nope, oh, and he goes. just flies away. Let's follow him. Okay. <laughs> That's essentially what he said. I forgot that I'm supposed to be reading those lines. Like, I forget everything. Alright. <laughs> yeah, we're back here again. Yep, I'm just gonna forget those enemies because who needs them, right? Yeah. Alibaba, uh, he finds a cave and, uh,. All the people who threw money in the cave are trying to kill him, but Alibaba's slave girl foils their plans. Hmm. That's the plot of the story, pretty much. Still better than Aladdin if it had Robin Williams. Yeah. I'm just I'm just gonna ride this random carpet. My mom told me not to trust not to mess you. with random carpet carpets, especially when they offer me rides. Oh, jeez. Oh no! The monkey's already sunken. <laughs> oh, we're too late. Goodbye. <laughs> oh, no. I guess I'm the main character of Aladdin now. Marry me, princess. Let me die rich and happy. Forget Kyrie. Oh man, it's already too late. He's gone. Yep. No getting him back now. Ah, leveled up, though. Nice. Gotta think about the, the bright side, right? In his death, I learned how to level up. Are you still reading? Yes. I'm actually texting somebody right now. No. <laughs> I dare you. you I, I believe in you. You got this, man. You, you can carry this for a little bit. Oh, there he goes. Gorge, not again! Oh. oh! He got out of that real quick. Genie, get rid of these guys! I don't think that was his first wish. Yeah! Wish number one coming right up! Oh yeah. Guess what? Not not Robin Williams. Yeah, that's not Robin Williams. I know. I it, it's it's very familiar though. Thanks, Sora. Very similar. Aladdin, what that's are you what doing out here? Same old stuff, hunting legendary treasure. Oh man. Just paid a visit to the cave we sure did spend all night doing that. I found that magic yep. carpet. And this lamp. Wow. Legend has and a lamp. that whoever holds the lamp can summon Please, the kid, leave oh, the intros to a professional. The one and only genie of the lamp. Rub it up dub the lamp and have your dearest wishes granted. This winner is Aladdin. Congratulations. Well, whoever this is did a real good job at it. Yeah. When I first heard it, I thought it was Robin Williams. Goodbye, Genie. Aladdin, you're looking a little spacey there, bud. What drugs are we on? How about making me a fabulously wealthy prince? Whoa! Money, royalty, fame! Why didn't I do that? Okay, you asked for it. 
A hundred servants and a hundred camels loaded with gold. Just say the word and I'll deliver it in 30 minutes or less or your meal free. Hey, I'll even throw oh. in a cappuccino. <laughs> no thanks. Okay. I think I'll put that on hold until we reach Agrabah. Oh, why a prince? You see, there's this girl in Agrabah. You've been quiet. Jasmine. Oh, wow. Well. But she's I was, a princess. I mean, we have to let people and, uh, watch the story, uh, man. never fall for a guy like True. me. Princess? Jasmine? Oh, that's <clears throat> right. She's in trouble, Aladdin. What? Well, we gotta on, save her. Going? Let's go. Man, are you not at all looking spacey? Should 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 I keep Aladdin? I mean, you have to, man. This time you take go you can take Goofy though. No, now you only have Donald and Aladdin. There you go. Now I have nobody to heal me if I'm about to die. I got rid of my you white mage. You said you didn't want to take Donald anymore. Now it's Goofy and Aladdin. Fresh air, the great outdoors. I can fly. Oh, my hair spiky. Comes with a job. Man, Aladdin, are you you certain that you certain that the shirt's the only thing we'll be flapping around? Back to my portable prison. I'm lucky to not gonna lose the hat or your jeans aren't or your not jeans your pants aren't gonna flap around. I'm pretty certain his pants will flap around, but they're gonna stay on. Free you from the lamp. I know, but like the only thing animated on him right now is a little bit of his hair and the and the shirt. Yeah. After we help Jasmine. Oh. I cut my finger. You cut your finger? How'd you cut your finger? I don't know. I just feel a cut there. Huh. Oh, I'm like the other guy, but I'm in an Arabian outfit. And I breathe fire. Yes, he breathes fire, and I don't know why. Well, fire breathers are an are entertainment. Yeah, but I don't think it's an actual existence. That's a spider pot! No, yep. it's a real... Like... People breathe fire, like not legitimately, but like they fill their mouths up with a special type of either alcohol or some, even gasoline for some people. Yeah, but this guy just literally just pukes it out. Yeah. Like he, he doesn't put anything in his mouth beforehand. It's just like. Blah. Well, I mean, at that point, like, why don't you complain about the inaccuracy of these little floating things? You know what? I think come here to judge this game, okay? You're the one who brought it up. What are we talking about? Uh, where are we going? I don't remember. I think we're trying to get into Agraba, so we're just trying to progress. Man, can I can I say, never seen Aladdin use a sword to kill things before. Kind of upsetting. What does he usually do? I can't remember. Nothing. He jumps around on their heads and throws apples at them. He doesn't really fight with a sword. I imagine he has a sword. Well, no, he's a he's a riff rat, a street rat. Did you ever see the sequel? I think not. <laughs> no, I did not see the sequel. Neither did you. So you know he could have used the sword in the sequel. Gosh. <laughs> All I know is that the Aladdin I know would never use the sword, and it looks weird seeing him doing it. I was, hold on. So far, the Jafar is after Jasmine and this keyhole. Keyhole, huh? I could swear I've heard about that somewhere before. Really? Where? Now, where was it? Well, it's only been 2,000 years. 200. Or 200 years. <laughs> oh, yeah. I had a zero on there for you. Well, anyway, we've got to stop Jafar before it, it is too late. Hey. It's just disturbing seeing him wielding a sword when I, I'm used to, like, Tarzan doing it. Uh, hunting all the time. It doesn't seem weird to me. Natural. <laughs> seems natural? Yeah, it seems natural. Why is it natural for him to go beating people up with a sword? Uh, I don't know, man. It just is. Do I have to explain? Nah. I'm falling. Well, I mean, we need to make commentary, so please do explain. Okay. Uh, I don't know. I just think it's natural that if he lives in an area where he has to protect whatever stuff he has... He's gonna own a sword. And especially if he makes his living off of thieving. Makes all the more sense, doesn't it? 
Yeah, but he's a he's a nice thief. He doesn't kill people. When has there ever been a real life nice thief? Robin Hood. He still wielded a bow. I know, but this is Disney we're talking about. It ain't real life. I mean, even in the Disney, <laughs> even in Disney's Robin Hood, he wielded a bow. I understand that Aladdin didn't use his sword. Your point? It doesn't mean he didn't own one. Well, where's a thief gonna get a sword? What is he just gonna do? Run around like he's berserk or something, and like the berserker from Borderlands just punch everything? Well, he throws baskets and outwits his enemy. That's dumb. That's what he does. <laughs> yeah, but how's he gonna do that in a Final Fantasy type-ish game? I'm not. Yeah. This has been the episode of debate, but let's go ahead and put a pause button on this. Get something next time. Uh, next time? Yeah, next time. You know what that chest just gave me? The next episode. Thunder.